What's going on, fellow artists? Welcome back to YouTube's premier storyboarding channel, Ink and Grow Rich. Today's episode will be the latest in my portfolio projects series of videos, where I will select one of my previous jobs and hand you all the materials that I received to start of the game. Not only will this give you an idea of what you can expect on future jobs, but it'll also allow you to take the horse by the reins and add a few spots to your ever-growing portfolio. Now, the whole idea here is to try to keep these videos nice and tight so I can post them as frequently as possible. So, with all the bells and whistles neatly trimmed away, today we'll be looking at the materials for a Hotels.com series of spots that I drew up two years ago. These spots ended up getting a fair amount of airtime, so they may seem familiar to you. If so, great. If not, even better. <laughs> well, let's get started. Okay, so right off the bat, the first thing you need to know is that despite the fact that I've been saying Hotels.com this entire time, these scripts were actually for choice hotels. As I've said, it's been a few years since I drew these up, so eh, what do you want from me? Rather than go through these scripts line by line, I'm going to give you the benefit of the doubt and assume that you know how to read. All you need to know is that the entire campaign revolves around the fine folks over at Choice Hotels hiring a new consultant who's going to help spread their brand awareness. They're all sitting around in a conference room and are all eager to hear his new brilliant idea. He lays it on them in four words. Bada book, bada boom. That's it. That phrase is the cornerstone of this entire campaign. There are six spots total, one 30 second spot and five 15s. Each one of them slightly different, but all of them revolving around this guy saying, bada book, bada boom. You've probably seen these spots because like I said, they did get a lot of air time. Either way, these are your six scripts and this is the first thing that you will normally receive when you get handed a job. The second thing you'll get is the director's treatment. Now, if you are not familiar with a director's treatment, it's a PDF he or she will put together at the start of each job, usually during the pitch stage. It's a visual guide meant to convey the director's vision to not only the client, but to the entire crew involved. So stylists, DP, wardrobe, storyboard artists, all of the crew should immediately understand what the director hopes to achieve. Lots of useful stuff in here, so absolutely read through it before embarking on that little storyboard odyssey of yours. Now, all of this material can be found in the description section below, but I'm making a point of showing you each page now because Google Drive has recently announced that they will begin deleting files that are over 30 days old. So if you are watching this video in the far-flung future, first of all, say hi to the doc for me. Hey, good night, future boy! No way, doc! Secondly, those files may well be deleted. If so, you can just pause on each of these pages and read it here. Okay, so now we get to the locations. For this particular job, they decided to build a few sets on a soundstage rather than find actual physical locations. Most of these spots take place in a boardroom with all of the choice hotel executives sitting around at a conference table and the new spokesperson standing at the head. Now what you see here is a perfect example of what I get handed to me on most jobs. The director essentially just grabs all of his crew members while out on their tech scout, myself included by the way, this is one of those rare cases where I was actually invited down to the tech scout and then simply has them all stand in for the eventual actors. So these photos not only show the location, but are meant to represent the blocking as well. Then the director walks around the room finding shots that he likes and wants to see represented in the boards. So these can be thought of as a combination of location photos and a director's shot list. Feel free to do exactly what I do, which is arrange the shots so they make sense with the script, and then simply trace the photos, changing the wardrobe and faces of it. And remember, these are boardroom executives, so shirts, ties, business tire, all around. Now, also keep in mind that you don't have to just trace these shots. If you want to add in some shots of your own, go nuts. I mean, if you've got strong storytelling skills and you want to show them off, you to do it, so knock your goofy little socks off. Now, there is one spot called, like I said, which does not take place in a boardroom, but rather at the lobby of the hotel. So there are photos here which represent that location and blocking as well. And finally, there are shots of the actual hotel room, which I believe is where the logo appears at the end of each spot. Okay, so hopefully this will get you excited and give you something to work on. Because once you've got these six spots drawn up and dropped into your portfolio, you'll be six spots closer to getting hired. All right, I think that's just about gonna wrap it up for today's episode. If there's anything I did here that was confusing or just wanna tell me how much you hate me, drop on down to the comment section below and hit me up, Buttercup. And as always, if you found these videos insightful or entertaining, or would like to see more of them in the future, go ahead and hit the subscribe button below. Until next time, this is Vinny Delay with Hagen Gurridge.